Um, you heard the Hey Ball Champion of Champions event along with Justin Sage from Australia. Justin Sage, welcome. Thanks, very nice to be here. You know, you're hailed as the number one ranked best player in the country at the moment. You're presenting Australia. How does it feel to put away those balls in the opening ceremony? Yeah, there's a lot of pressure and I'm just uh, very happy to be here and I'm uh, very privileged. Very privileged. He, he had to play, a, in the opening ceremony, we played a, a game, between, a frame, one frame between Bing Hung and Justin, and Justin got one opportunity and ran all the balls to the table, letting everybody know out there that Australians can play. How long have you been playing Chinese hate ball for? Um, I think my first event was uh, probably in about 2016, 2017 in China before the uh, sort of the lockdown and all that sort of happened. So I have played a, a while back, but um, more recently, yeah, a few more tournaments as, as of late, and I've got a table at home finally, so I can uh, practice a bit more. Do you find that you need to adjust your playing style slightly when playing Chinese hay ball as opposed to American style pool? Yeah, absolutely. The, the game and the tables are very tough, so it, it allows for a little bit more, um, well, I think it's a, more, a few more shots in the game, there's more errors from the opponents, which is not, which is, yeah, more common, I guess, with the tighter pockets and the equipment, so there's a bit more strategy involved. How do you uh, how have you prepared for this mentally for this weekend? Is it just relying on, relying on your raw talent, or have you got some kind of secret weapon that you've got? Um, no, not really. Just practice at home as much as you can. I, I did go down an event last week in Canberra, so that was a good um, good, good preparation. Good leader. Yeah, uh, Justin, it's always a pleasure seeing you. I wish you the very best of luck. Bring it home for Australia. Bring it home for Australia. Thanks for watching, guys.